friendos, welcome back, where we find some weird shit to talk about. Yeah. Let's see, where's the, the second friend? It's just a mother who hadn't drank in a while. Yeah. I mean, she got the chance to, and basically did what... I gather she drank what she used to be able to drink, or attempted to, because it did a... Ooh. Reading her post, I felt the pain. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. If it, if it was that bad, then she It was one of those, like, I could... I Like, I could... Like, feel oh. past hangovers of mine, and I was just like, Oh, honey. That I'm reminds so sorry. Me. Did you see the video... Did you watch that video I sent you? Of that drink called The Graveyard? No, I, I never did get around to it. What, what was... What was it about? It, it's literally like remember how I think it was a couple weeks ago we were talking about mixing our dark and light liquors. Yeah. Okay, let me pull up this video and read you the ingredients. Well, if it's mixing dark and light liquors, I imagine that it's not gonna be fun. No, I. I okay. just it is acid. Here's the gold wings, guys. So it's vodka, okay, and rum. Okay. It's white rum. It, it's the clear rum, and then gin, tequila. Jesus. There's more. Triple sec. All right. Bourbon. Sarah Strong is Riku. Scotch. Good lord. <laughs> Yeah, that sounds like uh, <laughs> and a, a, a lager, lager or a lager, like a light beer, and then it tops it off with Guinness. That is that does not sound pleasing at all. That that sounds like death. That sounds like a bad time. Like that's somebody making a drink just to make it make like and they're making like a, a drink with the intention pop. of getting sick. Like yeah, that's really stupid. Yeah. Yeah, it sounds like it. Yeah. Ah, I'm glad I didn't watch the video. It'd probably make me, like, gag looking at it. I drank enough alcohol in my time to pretty much have that eternal, like, remember the time I almost died night. Yeah. Because I've had a lot of those. Yeah. So if you're wondering why I'm using Wisdom Form, it's because, uh, well, I like having the uh, ability from the Wisdom Form. What ability is it? It's like the quick step. You hit, you hit square in a direction, and you basically slide that way. Mm. And the easiest way to replenish your drive gauge is, is to you know, use up all your magic and fight. Hmm. I always stuck with Valor. Well, Valor is good. But, uh, I like having all the abilities because I'm used to having all the abilities. Right. So, yeah, getting those back is its going to help me out playing this game. Because I feel like whenever you started a new game, after, you know, after playing, you know, the final bit of the game, yeah. you get used to, you have to try and get used to not having all your abilities again. not enough heartless. So we met the gold wings. The little theories. Little theories. Little theories. Fairy god parents. Ugh. I'm not gonna do the full volume because that hurts. It sounded like it hurt. I'm trying to figure out what's going on the rest of the day. Uh, 
Well, you don't have to work today, do you? No. Are they still waiting on your drug test to come back? Yeah. Alright. So. Oh, shit, dude. Sounds like it. Yeah. Blech. I figure the drug test is going to take a bit, because, I mean, it's been the weekend. Yeah. So. And then, of course, it takes a couple of days for it to get back to him. Yeah. Uh. They're going to be really pissed about the math. <laughs> <laughs> God, that is... That is something that you really don't want to do. No. It's... Uh... It always seemed like a bad idea whenever I, was, you know, saw people trying I mean, to do it. Like it. It. Like it. It's a very euphoric high, but I mean, you you are always going to have that opposite, the opposite end of it. And the, the come down from it is like crippling. I wouldn't know. Which is why I explained it. Yeah. Yeah. The, the AAP boost. How do you end up getting that one? Uh, you have to have the glide, uh, double okay. jump, and maybe the slidey slides. Oh. Stutz. That's a Stitch. I love Stitch. Stitch is always my favorite. How many... How much XP do I need for Wisdom to go up? 24? That means I gotta kill 24 Heartless. Huh. I think we're just gonna do Valor. I was going to ask what that other Keyblade was, and that just answered my question. Yep. I'd have an Oath Keeper on there myself, but... Well, I don't have... Uh, yeah, I did. Yeah, you yeah, got I, a, I you just got, got Oath Keeper. Yeah. Love how fast he runs. Oh, yeah. Like, it definitely moves faster in his drive forms. Oh, infinitely faster, yes. <sighs> Open the chest. Bacon and we're toast. back here. Bacon toast. Butter and toast. Yeah, toast! Oh, man. And... Where's that case for stupid? Huh? Part one of Super. It's over there. Okay. Or no, wait, it's over on this other shelf. Okay. We are going to figure out how many episodes we yeah. have. I imagine it would probably just be the Battle of Gods saga. Okay, so I've defeated all the Heartless here. I didn't realize the title of Gods was still called Dragon Ball Z. Yeah, Dragon Ball Z, uh, Battle of Gods, and Dragon Ball Z Resurrection F. Yeah. Uh, where is it over here? Handsome. Uh... I'll be right back, guys. Guess this must be his room. Master Key! Oh. Right for your fucking oh. face! Hey, you! Who, me? Yes, you couldn't be, then who? I'm looking for somebody. Have any of you seen a guy with yeah, I think you're right, I think it's just a battle god. Uh, he's got spiky hair. Episodes 1 through 13. I'll just take a really? Look. Yeah. How many discs? I should say it on here somewhere. Yeah, 
It does not. Oh yeah, two Blu-ray discs. That seems a little underwhelming. <laughs> Shame. But I'm glad that they didn't take a whole lot, a lot of time with the Battle of Gods or Resurrection of Sagas. Yeah. Now who was it that did? Uh... So you made it. Leah. The the Frieza villain with the unique visor. Oh, with the unique scouter? Yeah. The visor scouter. Uh, that was one of the. Uh... Isn't that one of the guys from uh, Team Four Star? Maybe I'm gonna check. It was supposed to be Takahata 101, but I don't remember his full name. Or I should say his real name. <laughs> You're not my real dead. Like how Leon says, computers are delicate. And then he let Sora type on it. Where's Where's he let Sora beat the fuck out of it. Yeah. Easy. You want to break it? Oh, sorry. Guess I got a little carried away. Oh, I forgot that video existed. What? Them do them reading Moody lines and the voices of Goku and Vegeta and Frieza. Yeah. Oh shit, the MCP. And then Donald takes one more step and decision gate breach. Arrest? Why are we under arrest? We didn't do shit. Okay. Look out! Run. Tagba. That's And now we're digitized. I like how it's a 2D model of Sora. Huh? Yeah, they did a 2D model of Sora to digitize him with the laser beam. Oh, yeah. And now we're in Tron World. Yay! Space Paranoids. Materialize. Who are you? That dude? Yeah. No idea. He died recently. Oh. Observe. Yeah, it made me sad. Okay, you're the boss. I get it. And God. This would look really fucking weird in 3D. Like with the red and blue 3D. Yeah. Because everything's red and blue. <laughs> Though I was super excited that they used this, this type of Tron instead of the new one. Because I think Tron Legacy was about to come out. Or something like that. No, no. This, this was long before Tron Legacy, because Tron Legacy came out in 2010? I don't remember. It was 2010, because that's the same year I got Cali. Yeah, I 
to advance his private research. Hmm. My name is Tron. Some dude named Marcus Salazar. I don't know why I thought it was somebody notable, but... I mean, he does a lot of voice acting, evidently, but I thought it was somebody I knew. Hmm. Like, personally, or just... No, just like a voice actor I was familiar right. with. There is one character that is voiced by James Marsters. You must be users. Users? Yeah. You know what he did. Yeah. He was actually the only good thing about that. What, evolution? Yeah, his, his acting. And he was a fan of Dragon Ball, so he was just like, I, I wanted it to be as close as the original, but he didn't have a whole lot to say over what the movie was. Yeah. Right. So. This terminal could have gotten you back to the user's world, but the MCP cut the power 50 microcycles ago. How long is that? If we bring the energy core in the canyon online. We could power it back up. The problem is, we're stuck in this cell. We're not going anywhere. Hmm, there's a convenient keyhole in it. Well, really, all you do is just beat the fuck out of it. And then unlock it with a keyblade. I love how all the keyblades have a Tron look to them. That is pretty cool. I wonder what this looks like. Oh, that's pretty rad. Yeah. Anyway, guys, we're going to go ahead and end it right here. If you liked it, you know what to do. If you didn't, sorry about you. Till next time, you guys stay frosty. See ya.